Yeah, I'm gonna see if we can finish this up tonight. Okay. First, we're getting rid of that third place and replacing it with the first place. categories and literally zero runs for just about all of them. Yeah, and that's a game that's approaching five years old. <laughs> so it's like, ah. I can tell that I've done something. So how did the uh, Wii Sports thing get started? Uh, because what we were trying to set up PS2 Crash game you need me to. I mean, I'm not. I'm not going to do that. I did go by, but I just kind of played that out. It's far away. Right. Well, talking with Lucy, yeah, it's pretty much just like nothing works, at least nothing that people have found. Of course, the not being a comfortable version of the game, people have really dedicated a lot of time to it. I feel like messing with it. Like, might as well, right? Yeah. Well, with what I do in my any percent 120 runs, it's not like I'd be doing anything really different because I don't really pull off any major tricks or anything. It's completionist categories because I don't really know. Crowd. I'm just kind of making that up as I go along.
Is that Pander still streaming at 3 in the morning? Holy shit. Possibly, I haven't really logged on to it today. Gotcha. Just been busy and tired or something like that. Oh! Uh, oh! Uh, if it's, okay, if it's something you don't want to talk about, we don't got to talk about. No, I just, uh, I'll be honest, I don't remember what I did today. <laughs> oh, wow. PS2 decided to be like, yeah, no, I'm not gonna read anything anymore. Well, get that is a bit of a worry. Yeah. That's alright. All I gotta do is just maintain my console mode. I mean, you can't help it with the light. It'd be a little concerning if that was the case, though, because that's not an old laser. Hey, Unidorsal, what's up? I am currently trying to win this championship in Luke's favorite car. I might have made it. percent is probably just the best way to just go for it. Yeah, kinda. 
I mean, it's also frustrating as well to be like, oh, I've got two pieces of evidence, but I need the third one to confirm the ghost, even though I pretty much know what it is. Right. Hey, Basti, thanks so much. Oh, that reminds me. I need to figure out a figure out something for bits badges. Menu book. Collection. I don't even think I've touched that. <laughs> yeah. Are all three cars for GT to the one six respond? Ruh-roh, what happened? Can't use this content. What? Use this book. Bro, what? what? Uh. Your game crash? <laughs> I hope not. What? Uno momento, por favor. Boop. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna just reboot this thing and see what happens. That's a little wonky though. Yo, I'm back. Hello. Oh God, it's so nice. I'm home alone for one day. And it's just so nice being able to talk. At a normal voice. I love it. Yeah. Okay, we'll try this again. Can't use this content. Ruh-roh raggy. Oh, I don't know if these are a thing in America. Let me listen to chat. Uh... Oh my god. Tex, are you there? Mm -hmm. If you look in the voice text, I don't know if they have them over there, but bro, I bought these. Surely that's a thing in Australia. Yes, yeah, Splice. I bought these for the first time in so many years, and oh my god. Dude, Splices are Literally fucking... the best. Dude. Also the Mount... Oh wait, I guess they are the Mount Buller Splices, aren't they? Yeah. Mount Buller, just the Buller Splices. Just Buller. That this is a mountain. Was I always got it weird. Yeah, why did it lock you out of your game? That was wacky. You know, I kind of wonder if it's because, like, something went weird with the game sharing dealio. Because. Okay. Oh, is this the new Grand Trisma? Yeah, it is. Let's see your header part. Mm. In progress. <sighs> okay. Well, essentially, what I just did was bought the digital version of the game for myself. So not only do I have one that's kind of in limbo because I don't have a mailing address right now. And yeah, <laughs> we're, we're being chillin. We're, we're fine, we're good. So you have a physical copy in limbo? Yeah, it's for whatever reason, just we're not. 
Well, okay, it's in limbo because A, GameStop takes five million years to mail something out. B, um, where I was getting my mail, unfortunately, the guy who ran it passed away and his family isn't wanting to continue the mail service there. So, it's in limbo. Damn. Yeah, but what you gonna do? Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, I should probably take this thing out a little bit more. This is literally the best ice cream I've ever had in my life. Ooh, what kind of ice cream you got? Splices or splits? Were they used to called? Are they called splices? Or am I thinking of something? Wow, I don't know. What the? Is it called splits now on the box? I thought called splices. I think there's another one called splice. Every brand has like their own version of it. I think that's what it is. Yeah, no, splice. Bro, you, the image you sent me is a splice. From I think Streets. Bulla renamed theirs to Splits then. Yeah. And then Streets is Splits. Bulla. Yeah, Bulla has Splits. Okay. I prefer Splits, to be honest. Bro, that's what I'm having now in my color. my Wii is working, and it is, and that shit is fine. Look 
245 is ready. Yep, Daytona in uh, Florida. Oh, okay, I should have, I should have uh, looked up at the, at the track shape. I probably would have. Okay. If I'm honest, a lot of the ovals blend together for me. So, like, if you told me this was Talladega, yeah, I'd be like, sure. I think Talladega is more like triangle shape. Is that or is that a different one? I'm not as familiar with NASCAR tracks. If I'm being honest. One's about to join and show me how to install this Mega Pwn shit. Sorry if we're spamming the VC. He's glitching. Okay. Yeah, it was crazy. They was playing. Uh, they was playing some uh, game a while ago, and I <laughs> remembered like one of the Japanese tracks just by the shape of them because it was in like a fucking mm -hmm. NASCAR '98 game that I used to play or some shit. Yeah, it was like Suzuka or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, Blunt. What's up? Hey, Blunt. What's up? I'm here to help waffle with this megaphone. Hopefully it works. Mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, it should work, because yeah. we, we have the exact same model, and it works fine for me, so I don't see why it shouldn't work for you. It, it, I installed it twice, and both times it installed... Well, it, it said it was installed, and the, the, the disk version was fine. But it was just a black screen when I try to run burn disk. But I'll show. Ugh. What the fuck? The owner of the company then was Henry Ford, and he'll always be remembered as the man who revolutionized the industry. Much more charitable than how I remember him. Henry Ford was 
probably someone I would not want to meet. <laughs> Plug the what now? The easy cap, like the oh, no. <laughs> USB to opposite cable. Mm. This is just stop. What's your regular caps code? What do you use? I have no data because I just do just using. Oh yeah. I'm scaling. What up, Scale? Using use one of those like those like, fucking square ones that you buy on eBay, or yeah, yeah. I have a couple of I have a couple of those. Some of them are actually quite good. Some of them might be bad. Oh yeah, I didn't know this all. Yeah, they seem to vary in quality depending on who you buy them from. Uh, yellow. White and red are for the left and right channels. There's a good chance, by the way, that when you use your, uh, when you make a opponent to an NTC console, the captures might not work like fully because uh, the signal outputs they're probably not might, they might not recognize it, but they might. I don't know. It depends. But, uh, it's a pretty easy workaround for that. They should be able to see it, but this, it, it, it'll either be like in black and white, or it'll be like really, uh, really, uh, kind of fuzzy or something. Uh, everything was fine until it, it just booted into the game, and if I booted it without using ESR, it would be a blind screen, and if I booted it using ESR, it would be a blind screen. 
it the disc would spin up, but like it would just stay black and do nothing. What's what's ESR? Sorry. Uh, it's, it's like in the boom room in good games. I don't know. I just tried it. But okay. It would it would just stay black. Like, We tried doing the. Uh, you could try going to back and restoring the backup to restore all the console to how it was previously. In the console. Yeah. You have a TV or not? What do you play through? Uh, through go go PS. Oh, I do. does affect proxies, if the frame rate's lower then proxies would be worse. It was just like not even shooting me in the correct direction. It's knowing because in Inspire 2, it's hard to practice total proxy on on Popsonic, because like, that area like lags still a little bit more. It makes the proxy like way more hard, way, way more difficult. Not all the time, but sometimes it just lags a little bit more, so it's, it just doesn't work. If you want to have a look at my capture, I'm going to show you what the process should be. Yeah, I just mapped it to the, uh, I don't really use it, but it's, it's there, but it's kind of handy. Yeah. Is that the pop sound version, or like the burnt disc version? Uh, that's, so, in Free Room Boot, you can actually just map ELF files to the main menu. And yep. that's what I've done here. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, just want to make sure I'm selecting the right menu here. So, I've not booted this up in a while. Just make sure that the, uh, picking up option.
Okay, so it's the second one. So change region, dex, um, select the model, and then again select DTL seventy five hundred for USA, and then oh don't yeah, you and then don't one? do force on. Yeah, so on so on PAL you have to choose a specific model to Tex change. Was right, holy yeah. shit! So on NDSC you can you can just you I'm sorry do that. what. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. It's yeah, it's because on, on the NDSC version way well, is different than the power version, you have to like yeah. select a specific model to change it to. Um so yeah, Dex uh, change select like your model and then And then USA. USA and then don't install force unlock and that's what you do. And that should be good. Okay. Wow. Force unlock is like the yeah. Force <laughs> unlock is what you do if you wanna play DVDs. And only it just disables you yeah, because yeah, it, it breaks does, it. Yeah. I can just hey, I'll do that. That's pick. very helpful. Wow. Yeah. Okay. That, and that, that should just fix it. I can just pick <sighs> up Tex's face like with the like most smug expression right now. <laughs> Tex, thank you for helping me two hours ago. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I had the same issue because it wouldn't work for me initially, and I I just messed around with the settings for a while and eventually figured it out. The power installation is different, and uh, there's very little documentation on power microphone. At least there was when I was messing with it. Well, on the GitHub, it literally says select the model. Okay. Yeah. Then I selected my model, and then boom. All right, let's see it work. Uh, Keep working. Yeah, um, this, by the way, this, um, there's a little piece of software that's really, that you probably might need, uh, I never mapped, I never mapped my stuff in here anymore. I might check out my sick you launch off the theme, by the way, be cool. Um, oh, I'm not at, I'm not at my computer, I'm just doing this fucking bullshit. Yeah, uh, PlayStation 1 video mode negator, um, you may need that. For it to display your games correctly, but you might not. Uh, what it does is the microphone outputs in like um, I think it's M it's, it outputs in like a weird NTSC signal that not a lot of upscalers can support, especially cheap ones. But cheap upscalers they can't see it. So what PS1 video mode negator does is it forces PS1 games to run at a proper NTSC signal. Um, so they'll be picked up by a yeah, upscaler. I actually might that might have broken my upscaler just then. I probably didn't so, break it. it. I mean, not to make well, it. Well, not break it, I mean, like, not let it work. Yeah, yeah. It, it's possible that, that was the issue. Um, because the game, it would be running in a different signal. You, even, even like, the, the main menu would be running in, like, a different signal. Um, so it's possible that I just couldn't see it at all. X. Retail decks. Yeah, the other second option, yeah. Second option. is 2500 USA. Yeah, USA, and then don't install force on work. It doesn't even give me the option to install that, so... Am I using an old version or something? I don't know. I don't know. Like, I think, yeah. It's, yeah. I mean, if it doesn't work, then you can restore back to default using the backup and then try it again. Yeah, let me just grab... Uh, Sparrow 1. Okay. I also need to patch my PS2, as in... Um, the disc tray, I know there's a way to fix it, where it's like, the disc tray is quite fucked, and you have to like, put weight on the PlayStation. Yeah, mine's like this. that, mine's like that as well, yeah. It's very, it's, I don't have to wait, no, but it's very finicky sometimes, if I, if I even just touch the disc tray, or like, the disc will stop reading. But these things I've taken the lid off a bunch of times, and it's gonna mess with the, uh, the full work. Senses that sense whether or not this tray is open or closed. That's probably what happens. Alright, let's see if it should work. It should say in the main menu uh, DTL 7 one. It has also changed resolutions and stuff, but. Yeah, it should be. It's happening in NTSC now, not in PAL. PAL. It, it's not doing 576i, it's doing 460. Yeah, oh, yeah. It's, yeah, because PAL outputs in a slightly higher resolution than NTSC. There's a higher, I think, like a vertical height or something, resolution wise. Would you look at that? It's fucking working. Let's go. Yeah, uh, thank cool. you. So yeah, when you um, so you, can tr you might be able to try it with the upscaler now and see if it works. It probably won't. Yeah. If, if it's, yeah. 
it's possible to be upscaled can't see the signal at all. Um, unless you go into graphics synthesizer mode and then change the main menu to output in NDSC, that'll work. But that's, that's a little workaround. Yeah, I'll just let it Really, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm really not angry. I mean, I, I made the same mistake as well. It's just like everyone tells you to like do it in some way, and then it just doesn't work, yeah. pal. Yeah, I'm blaming process. fate. I'm blaming fate. Well, no. I mean, fate, oh, fate's no. Fine. no. I'm joking. I'm joking. Yeah. I mean, he's from the DC regions. So Wolf totally is spot. a gentle lamb who would not I steer know. you wrong. <laughs> he would never steer you wrong. Okay, he needs something. Listen, it got no sleep, it's, you know. <laughs> yeah. This cable though is actually fucked, I need a new one. It's like, I must have broken it as a kid, and my dad, like, soldered the leads together and, like, twisted oh, yeah. them together. They are <laughs> fucking. Oh my god. You can buy uh, SWV cables off of eBay. They're pretty, uh, they're not the highest quality ones, but they're fine. I use one. Hey, um, they work. Yeah, and I think it's like the PS2 SVD cables have both composite and SVD at the same time. So you like, just use. Either one. You get like the split way that like, you know, you run the S video to the capture card, but you just play the TV with the composite. Okay, plugged in. God, please work with the upscaler, I'm begging. I mean, it might. Either you won't see it at all, or it'll be like a weird signal. Because I imagine a... All those kind of square little capture like upscalers, they all I don't think any of them can properly detect the signal that is upwards. I mean they are cheap, they are yeah. shit. Yeah, I've I've two of them, they're both yeah, very cheap. But they do work. For the most part. Uh, it was working before, I was just confused. Yeah. Why it just randomly USB power. You know what? I'm not gonna plug it to the PlayStation, I'll plug it into But if it doesn't work, there's a workaround that I can. Uh, well, there's two workarounds really, um, but I do recommend you get. Because uh, you, you have, you, I assume you have free boot, right? Or yep. some sort of. Yeah. I do. Um, oh, yeah, you want to download a. Oh, it is cool. Is it? Is the image oh, fine? Shit. It's not. It's not fucked up. Oh, it's. It's moving. It's actually running away. Look. Are you getting the rolling the rolling image or what's that? What's happening? Uh, you can see on my OBS, I think. Uh, you don't lie. I'm, I'm sure. like, look at my webcam. Oh, all right. Oh, right. Yeah, sorry. Also, hold on. Where's my free make food gone? Let me just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, that, okay, so that's what I had here. The weird glitchy. Okay, so... Yeah, so that's fine. Honestly, it doesn't matter. Like, it's, it's, the menu will be glitchy. But... Where's my free make food gone? Not my menu. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Uh, yeah, this is the thing. Okay, so... So, um, is that also? It's like a weird server okay. Yeah, it is. So, Megaphone, um, for free food to work with it properly, uh, I think you have to install, um, the, what's it called? The, the, the uh, no, it's, um, it's like the multi region version, that's it. You have to install the multi region version of, of free food. Oh, yeah. Oh my god. That's I'm gonna really I do need to because I need to change the video. Because I can't change it. Yeah, another little fit Now this is just this is just the uh the snap scale. This is all on the upscale side. So the output's not weird signal, so it comes. You can fix this by the way, it's just uh, a joining the work of the game, so what can work on that? I think in the uh, in, in the um, the what's it called in the Ruby boot installer, uh, there should be a, there should be a way just to change it to uh, the multi-install version. 
Yeah, it's multi region. Right, right. Yeah. This is what mine does as well with the little two box code. But the way you get around okay. this is you would use a. Install. The it's, I think it's an option within within the free boot installer itself. Um, How do I access it, that if, it, if I can't see it uh, Do you have the do you have the DVD version? Or not? I do. Yeah, I found one. So that actually comes with lunch. Yeah. Uh, let me just see this audio time. And. Yeah, I, I remember this happening yeah. as well, um, but I was lucky because I had uh, two PS2s, so I could just like, plug it in, the other one to change it there. I was about to say, cool. that looks like it's... That looks like right a slide story, right? Yeah. It's yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go do Shim. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, the strat for getting rid of this, or the, the strat for kind of like working around this is, um, with free boot, you can actually like boot up old files with a hotkey, with like a, with a, I guess a hotkey. You can like hold down like square. And when you boot the console up, what that'll do is it'll boot into uh, PS1 video mode negator, which will then you then boot into your game from that and it will force an anti SC uh, force an anti signal, which will uh, which will, will fix this fucked up screen image thing. Yeah, it's it's all very easy once it's Cap will just give you like a, a straight black and white signal without any uh, annoying glitchiness. But you can change that in the Elgato game. Oh, I wonder. No, I bet the upscale is doing this, not the. Yeah, this this is the upscaler. The, the, up, the upscale is doing this, not the capture card. Let me just one more thing. Let yeah, NTSC four four three. This wasn't working for either. This was actually a PS2 game. Okay, well, I'll follow real quick. What's the it's correct awesome. order for uh, Fire 3 any percent, the first home home? Like the. Like, what's the order you're supposed oh, to that's go? The, oh, that's a DVD. Um, mm -hmm. you're meant to go. Villa, Tanax, Seashell. Seashell. And then Molten, Molten. And then Cloud. Cloudy, and then Shield. Oh, okay. I guess I heard so. Please work. Oh. How? I can't imagine that'll work, right? Fuck. Why isn't this working? What the hell? Well, because you are, I mean, with, with the, it's a DVD, so it's, you can't play DVDs with the, with the... Oh, can I not play PS2 game backgrounds? 
fuck. Only, so that's what the, that's not when it's not force unlocked, right? So the force unlocked makes it so DVD games can be played, and without that, DVD backups cannot be played. Oh, so, so you want to do the force? Is it, is it? So I have to switch between them, like. I think so, yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I didn't play any PS2 games of mine, so I don't know. it's not been an issue for me. But. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not really sure how it works at the, uh, on the DVD side, so I don't have any experience with this. So. No, 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 like, like, doing the full song, not full song. Yeah, I have to... Now I have to install... What's it called? The... Yeah, the multi, the multi, uh, region, uh, whatever it's called, yeah. It's on, if you're going to GitHub, if you're going to GitHub, there's actually, uh, I think it says something about it. Yeah. So, uh, multi-install. Can I install... I would imagine a CD could work as long as it could fit. But I've never done the. Uh, I've actually I've never actually used the, uh, the DVD version of it, so I'm not sure. Oh, it would have to be it. Oh, oh yeah, you got your launch shelf. Yeah, yeah, this is fine. You're, you're good. Yeah, if you have access to your launch your shelf, you can fix everything else, I think. So, yeah. so now you want to um, find um, a the the uh, Beer and Boot installer, if it's on here. I don't know if it is. But is the, is the disc version of Yoncho? Yeah. Yeah, nice. If you didn't have this, I think it'd be screwed. Like you have this. Yeah. Because you wouldn't, you wouldn't I, have I, any access I point. I just there. picked up discs and stuff today. Yeah. Because I was like, yeah, I want to fucking start playing on this. <laughs> yeah, you, you'd be locked out of being able to like, access this if you didn't have a disc of it. Because uh, the memory card uh, wouldn't work without the proper version of the boot installed. So. Yeah, luckily, luckily the discs work fine here. Yeah. Um, because if they didn't, you'd be, uh, you'd be locked out of it. Okay. So. I mean, you can you can uh, get rid of Macapone for now. If, if you if you uninstall Macapone, uh, it would work again. But you don't need to uninstall it because you, you should just be able to install the, uh, the multi this? install. Them. Oh, so I should install the multi version onto my hard drive and then install it. Like. Uh, well, I think if you just download, if you get the free and boot installer from like wherever you download it from, there should be like a multi-region version that you can you can get. Um, yeah, and then I but, can access it through this and then install it onto my memory. I believe, yeah. I mean, you can just throw it on your you can throw it on your USB or whatever, whatever you're using to access yeah. files. Yeah. Let me do that real quick. Okay, so, what version is the newest? Is that GitHub? It's on a like, PS2 phone or something. Yeah, version is uh... multi-region though yeah I, I can't remember if the I can't remember if it just has like multi-region just packed in with the original installation honestly I can actually check I have it on here somewhere uh, would, yeah okay so I've installed here and boot to this and boot it Yeah, 
you have multi installed, that's the option you can select once you get into this menu. Yeah, one point one one point nine point one point six one point nine six six. Yeah. It's the version. Yep. I think I'll install it first, yeah. and then that, that'll that'll set you from a fresh fresh start. Not X, yeah, it's X, X to a to not so Oh, that's why <laughs> they switched up. Uh, yeah. Yep. I don't know. Please. Okay, oh, I see. Okay, I, okay. So downgrade. So uninstall MI. Oh, yeah. See, either yeah, the same thing. You know? So it, it said I had a mold install, and it didn't work, and I just reinstalled it, and it all worked. So, I like so. I didn't pre make boot this memory card. I had bought it. Yeah, I did the same thing. Yeah, so make sure not to turn off the power because if you install your boot and turn it off, I mean you can just reinstall it again, but just just like I said, unless it tells you. Yeah, with a uh, with a with a CD or a disc of uh, you want shelf, you should really never, you should always be safe to uh, like completely like uninstall it because then you can just install it again by the disc. So as long as you have the disc, you can't really you can't really go wrong. You should, you should be safe. Yeah, I was scared for a second. I was like, I just burned that onto a DVD. I might be. Yeah. Screwed. The, the only way I I, I don't have the disc, so I do I actually use my other console, console to fix everything. Um, I was scared for a moment. I thought I'd break my console, but uh, so when I when I booted into it after installing Freemium Boot, sorry, I didn't make a phone that like none of the Freemium Boot stuff was there. I was like, oh no, what did I do? But then I uh, I looked into it a little bit more and realized it's just a, a, a quirk with it. Wow, it's just taking a while. Yeah, it's, it's fine. It's just probably it, it's slow to work, I guess. I gotta get water. Oh, it'll be not done by the time I. I'll get water one second. Well, actually, no, I'm using my shit, Mike. You guys are coming with me. Mm -hmm. I love wireless headphones. Thank you. 
Let's see what's in this. Damn. I'm pretty sure I remember the second wall for me as well. Yep. Always the small stack of change. Oh, I had something. Wow. I did. I'm going nuts. I should start looking for a new controller. Hmm. Place. Station controller. That can be cheap. No, but that's not going to be cheap. She. Oh my god. Dude, copy image. I'm putting this in voice text. What? That's fucking a splice. Hold what? on. Yes, bless you. Yeah. Wrong one. <laughs> Look oh, at that. Oh I my god. god. <laughs> oh yeah, I've got one like that. Really? Mm. What, left one, yeah, absolutely god. eaten up, yummy. And yep. then the right one, never a little bit. Hey, let me have a look at this one. <laughs> How much are they trying to sell that for? 40 bucks! Bro, oh, I do have, listen, geez. I do have one that has the left that's completely come off, but the rest of the control is fine. I, would, I wouldn't pay $5 for that, come on. Bro, I would pay $1 for that. I'd have to look on Trade Me, there's none in cashies. Do you want my old controller? Does it work? Uh, yeah, I was just getting sick of the phantom inputs. Uh, oh. Phantom inputs. Uh, I mean, I'll have it, but like... Hi, we're fine. It's fine. Don't, wanna, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't want a ghost playing tricks on him. PlayStation 2. It's honestly how New Zealand is. It's actually gonna like be cheaper to buy a console and a controller because hey, cunts well. are selling them for f bucks on their own. And if I go on Cashies and look at PlayStation 2s, I get a PlayStation 2 and a controller for 50 bucks. Hey, listen, Waffle, all I'm saying, dude, is... Wait, holy shit. This is in Auckland. Is this worth? Look at this. What is, is that a genuine controller? Let's see. Uh, that's a dual shock one, yeah. That looks to be in good condition. Can't really tell from my life looking at it, but oh, tags don't tempt me, bro. What's the man? Sixty <laughs> bucks on discs and bunny equipment today, and then two hundred and fifty on the pink PS2 and controller. Does that come with a black controller too? Oh, it does. Damn. How long has that been up, by the way, that pink PS2? You reckon I could talk them down a little bit? Uh, I don't think you can look at when the things went up. Can you? Make an inquiry. Yeah, my name is James. Oh, my. Message. Would you do 200? Is that a real big low ball? Would you do 200? 210. 210 for this listing. Thank you. I mean, if, if it's 210, I'm just. Yoink! Oh, and remember the person I emailed text about that pink PS2 on eBay? I was like, can I have pictures? You know what they said? We don't have pictures, but it's in good condition. <laughs> yeah, real trustworthy. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was like, okay. But yeah, listing says you can control the black controller for games without a cable. All these games. Got Sim Star, Starface, Sims 
Uh, Alright. God, Melton. <laughs> Wait, Scarface did all the zeros. That GTA by City Club. Oh, look, I actually found $20 controllers. Text, dude. Don't even worry about it. Look at voice text. This is $20. Looks. That's I feel real. Like I'm about to see some. That's a Sony Dual Shock if I've ever seen one. Oh, dude. Brand new, never been used. It looks like it'd fall apart. Like, <laughs> yeah, I you know, know. What? It, you know what? It probably. Wait, no, it's definitely not real. That's no, that's not real. That's like hard part because I was like, I was about to be like, I can see someone like accidentally like, well not accidentally, but like. That's actually fucked that I can't buy a controller around like forty bucks. It's fifty dollars or over for a real one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I snatched that pink that's controller that I got. That's crazy. Because that was thirty dollars plus like ten dollars shipping. I was like, yoink. Like if I can't find one, I'll cash these and trade me. That's I know that I can't find one for a good price. Okay, I'm gonna have to. Facebook Marketplace. Oh, that's a good shot. I don't have much trust in Facebook Marketplace, but we'll see. There'd be a PlayStation. Alright, can you just scroll up? I used Facebook Marketplace because I got stabbed once. Just once? No, there's nothing on here. Really? Yeah. Dude. Yeah. Shop 4. PS5. Uh, $250 for a normal PS2 slot. Let me see what I was going to oh, have. Yeah. Wait, yeah. You know what's funny? I, I was looking this morning and Cashies has a listing for a, like a, a chrome silver PS2. It's, it's still in its box. Like it has its box with the controller and everything. And they're like not scratched at all. For 200 bucks. I was like, damn. It's not bad. I wouldn't buy it personally, but that's not bad. Yeah, we was. There's. That's the. This is the longest I'm still in water. Is it stuck? I mean, I don't think so. I don't remember my taking a while school. I just like watch videos. But it looked like it didn't work. <laughs> if the disc has stopped spinning, is that why it's not working? Uh, no, because it shouldn't be, uh, it should just be, like, all, like, solid okay. state stuff at this point. Oh, look, 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 look at the tear on the floor. Oh, this one's Oh, yo. Let's have a look. Grey? That's not... Ah, oh, it doesn't zoom in. Uh, nah. Nah, I'm good. That one looks gross. That's what I use. Oh, dude, they posted a photo of the controller, the, the, the arse photo of it, the... Oh, PS1 controller. Oh, no, it's half open costume. Ooh! No. No, it's fucking ganji. Alright. It is gunged up. These grey controllers are brown. What? There is no controllers in this country. What the fuck? God, imagine a black PS2 controller that is going yellow, bro. What? Is it possible? Oh my Hello. god. 25? Is that how much it costs? Damn, that is. Damn, yeah, mistaken. <laughs> oh no. Ew! No! Got a couple of shiners in there. <laughs> Great. That's.
<laughs> that's the first controller I've ever oh, seen. Oh wait, there's an even worse one, bro. That's oh. the first controller I've ever seen with a staff infection. Dude, oh I my can't god, tell memory card, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Great. No. <laughs> No! Hang on, dude. I can't tell if this is rust oh. or if this is straight up dirt. Uh. Mm. I'm not sure that... Oh, the ass picture. They really don't bother with cleaning it up, bro. Yeah. That is so gross. $29 for tetanus. Goddamn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. No, thank you. That tetanus? Yeah, of course it's coming through stuff. <laughs> Dead. Dead tetanus, <laughs> though. If they won't come back with the 210, I might buy that fat console and the white DS1 for 60 bucks. I mean, that's not I mean, bad. D assuming the DS1 works, it's like that's the best controller you can get this far along. And that's the only good controller at that price point. And at that, it's just like, oh, it just comes with a PS2. It's sad. PS2 controller. Here's another uh, PlayStation controller, but you know, it's, it's kind of yellow. Or maybe that's the lighting. Yellow stitch. Oh, yeah, these ones will be a lot more. Should we take the PlayStation controller for $4? Ah! That works, it looks like a. Oh. Alright, what poor kid got that? Oh my god. Yeah, at least product warranty is seven days. Oh. I'm starting to think this uh, wipe is stuck. I do remember taking a very long time for me, but I, I can't imagine being stuck. This one's looking kind of clean, it's nine, nine bucks. That's, that's actually really good. It functions. <laughs> the analog sticks are fucky a little bit, but I have a D-pad on me, so... It, it's gonna be a crocket for $50. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Black Cashies has the, the good gems. I just got a... Oh yeah, I, 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 I know. Dig deep. I, I don't know. I gotta log on yeah. every day. Yeah, yeah I, I have a bookmark. <laughs> yeah, I got a, uh, a clear, a little digital PS1 controller. With the clear plastic one, pretty cheap. Yeah, that's Surprising just how much like, good stuff you can find there, generally. Yeah. It's also amazing how much stuff you can find. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of merchandise that Tex and Wobble have shown me on that site that make me feel like you're gonna have to like see a hazmat crew or something afterwards. There's the something organic on it and you don't know what. Organic is <laughs> such a good but awful word. Wait, yo. Okay, I've I've actually found some decent listings, I think. Oh, I'll put a couple of these in the chat. Tell me if these are alright at this price point. This is... This is actually... Oh, not that one. Yeah, let me know, you guys, if these are good. Is there around 30 bucks? I don't know about the green one. Uh, yeah, I don't know about the green one. It's that one thing. But the other two? Wait, did it go from like the forest green to they like look a look alright? Oh, never mind, that last one's a bit yuck. That second one's good. That second one does look pretty good. Where is this at? Yeah, the PS1. North Shore. Fuck. That, honestly, That's like the third $10 one... in fuel. Ah, uh, third one. Where's the third one? I don't know. The third if, uh, one's I, close. Yeah. I mean, there. Are, I don't know if the PS One or the PlayStation 
controller is better. I actually don't know what the difference is. I think maybe the internals are different. I don't know if the actual controller itself is different. So the white one is was one of the later released controllers, but then the grey one is one of the OGs. Same with the same with the green ones. A couple of the PlayStation controllers listed here, but then like from the Xbox controllers are Yeah, the stickless controllers are actually really good, but not really not really the Spyro one because it wants sticks. prices right now that would cost me ten dollars if you can get there and back that's not worth like look how you know what it is really really isn't hard to clean these controllers like it's, you have to wipe it down like a babe wipe for something it's like 10 seconds I'm surprised like all there were so many that you considering like, the quality dish. controls these right now that I'm seeing <laughs> anything holy fuck I might pick up that green one then and just clean it down. Because that's really close to me. Oh. Controls to be tested at any great working condition. I mean, you can, you can never trust them. You just have to, it's, it's, it's always a gamble, like buying controls and buying Yeah, you always go, you don't really know what great working condition means. Yeah, yeah. You just buy it at works. It's like, yeah, I can move in game. And then Hell you yeah. the disc onto it. Yeah. That's why I got that today. I was like, alright, I'm gonna buy one of each copy and play on it. Then one, I was like, wait, this is PAL, and two, that's 90 bucks. For 90 bucks, I got it for like, for like 70 bucks a day. I've got a DVD writer, five DVDs, and 50 CDs. It's like, that's yep. the same price, and that's 50 games. Oh, dude, Spyro 2 for $19 plus $6 shipping. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Yes, what? Nine dollars? Nine dollars with eleven dollars should be very cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know about this disc, bro. This disc is kind of sussy. Okay. Shit. It's the uh, platinum. It's a platinum, but there's like, it, there's, there's, a, there's a bit of, there's a bit of, there's a bit of stuff on it. <laughs> that looks fine. It's pretty cheap. Uh, yeah, it's that? Is that? Is it, light? It could, yeah, it must be a light reflection. I'm sure. It does look like a crack, though. No one, yeah, never a good sign when you go to see a listing and they ask you if you're up to date on your shots before you handle it. Yeah. <laughs> Can you take a, take a shot? Can't hold this, sorry. What's in my shopping cart? No cash, it's ah, oh, Nintendo Pearl. Nintendo Pearl version, yes. This item is no longer available. Rip. Any other ones? Ah, oh, Pearl. Twenty nine dollars for Pokemon Pearl, huh? bro. What's wrong with it? Where is this? How close are you to Moray Field, Queensland? Fucking nowhere near it. Ask Blunt. <laughs> Blunt, uh, are you in Queensland? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm Brisbane. Okay, can I ship this to you and then you ship it to me? <laughs> and also with the pink, where's the pink? Yes, dude. Is it also in Queensland? Let me check. 
the thing to get away. In case there's a melon, checking. I could actually go and get that. Okay. So you have to ship that one to me. <laughs> and then, Blunt, <laughs> you ship the pearl to me. I mean, I don't know how, if that'll be very uh, cost worth. I they don't let you ship to New Zealand on oh, right. Yeah, I see. But $29 for Pokemon Pearl is a fucking steal. Considering the one I just looked at was $129. <laughs> really? Fuck no. I, I have Diamond in Box and I have the loose, uh, loose car Pearl. Card. Diamond in Box? <laughs> diamond? You are on. You are sitting on diamonds, dude. You know, what do you mean in box? Like you haven't pulled that shit out of the case? Or... No, it, no, it's it's not it's not like like brand new, but it's I got the case and the manual and stuff. Ah, oh, well, yeah. I mean, I've got pearl with the case and that. Yeah. You got pearl with the case? Yeah, dude. What? I never How get much rid of that. How much ticks? How much ticks? Honestly, ten dollars or bust. No. <laughs> Eleven. Uh. <laughs> No, I need to check what's on that. Eleven dollars and a whopper. Oh, dude, that's that's a deal. <sighs> that is a bit of a deal. Look, I mean, I still have the case right, but the thing is, I'm in the pair of my shit, so it's probably a little bit dinged and dinged up. Oh, a mega boost, but the old. I hate it when it's like, oh, dude, ten dollars, and then it's like the whole dollar shipping. It's like, come on, dude. Some of these are really cheap, but four dollars, but. Like, dude, I sat on my Spyro case, you know? <laughs> oh, no. What is this? Dixon Road. <laughs> Where does Fady live? Queensland? Yeah, Brisbane. Fady live? Pretty close. Oh, Brisbane. Is Brisbane oh, in Fady. Queensland? I don't know how yeah, that ship works. Is it it's, it's, it's the capital. Yeah, Christmas capital of Queensland. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Queensland is massive. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. Queensland's the big. The, Queensland's the Florida of Australia. Top right <laughs> corner of Australia. Yeah. I mean, it's not even the biggest state. Western Australia is fucking huge. Yeah, Western Australia is just like, ah, uh, yeah, just happens. Florida, Australia. That is a place that does in not inspire chance, confidence. Oh. Yeah, Chadstone's like a really big shopping district. No, no, Chadstone. Dude, would it be quite a six dollars? No, 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 take the chat stop. Yeah, it's chat stop. No. Listen. Don't go there. It's always busy. It's shit. It's overhyped. It sucks. <laughs> Don't go there, bro. I'm gonna go to the Gold Coast instead. Oh, no, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> no, not tourist. Oh, well, yeah, tourist. Yeah. You're at that age that everyone would think you're a schoolie. A schoolie? Yeah, one schoolie. No. You go up to the Gold Coast and you just you get pissed drunk for like a weekend. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I still might go to Brisbane for that concert, I need to think about that. It's just the third $110 for that. I don't know. So, They're not going to fucking Hobart. Uh, dude, who the fuck of... Huh? Oh, fuck boy. that dude. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> dude, uh, just get a fucking ferry from Melbourne. You'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, I might go to the one in Melbourne and catch a ferry to Hobart. Or oh, Devonport, rather. Do you get seasick? 
pretty sure. Yeah, I, I used to do sailing. Okay. Get tickets. Let's see where this is at. Corner Hotel. Some big shit. Good. Fuck. I think this uh, I think the song's still white I should be but I'm fucking up stuff. Yeah. Should I just restart? Oh, well oh, the wrist this is not to, but like Yeah, I don't know what happened to you do. I'm kinda of afraid that it was broke your memory card, but I don't know. I've got another memory card. Oh okay. Oh Hi, I forgot we were waiting on this fucking thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well that one's can only do. eight megabytes. I don't know if that's what you can do is, uh, there is a, a, a thing you can, an LP you can download oh, called uh, Memory Card Annihilator. That just oh, yeah. Nice memory card. yeah. So I'll yeah, just turn it off and on. Yeah. I might go to the one at Quando Hotel and then catch a ferry to Tasmania. But you can, might just get to go back into the installer and just install it without yeah. installing it. Yeah, it might have actually work. wiped it. Yeah. The you can actually go into the memory uh, card here and see if it has any files. She sleeps at and low. Yes, this uh, card. It hasn't done anything. I, yeah. I should just try it again. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's yeah. There's the tickets. Um, yeah, you can just try installing it without installing it. Maybe, 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 that, maybe that works or something. You know. Dude, that shit is cheap! What the fuck? That's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I really want to buy some of these, like, shitty knockoff PS2 controls. It's pretty good. There's so many on the on the caches. I mean, honestly, people like... got them for a reason, you know? Well... I mean... Kind of. We got them when I was a kid, because they were cheaper, and I got one with, like, a skull on it, and I thought... Dude, I thought that shit was so... I mean, it's ritual, so yeah. Is this like a safe area? Uh, listen, if it was like, oh yeah, oh, no. it's been held in Collingwood, you would be like, fuck no! <laughs> Just try um just try doing the opt install from here and see if it works. Excellent. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, it's it's it. Oh yeah. You put uh no. Dude. Oh dude, I've been here. What the config is just like yeah. The config is just like your settings for the game. I mean yeah, I've been in this area. Oh. Yeah, nah, it's fine. Is it, this is fine. It's a, it's a bit industrial, but it's fine. Yeah, but Oh, that looks fine. Yeah, it's fine. That looks and, and it's got like the tram line right city. there. It's got a tram line right there, so you should be fine. Shit, huh? I would be fucked. You're not gonna drive me to the city. Oh. Oh. Hey, super so funny. Crash Bandicoot NTSC for fifteen dollars on cashies. What the fuck? Dude, what are they selling NTSC for? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. How'd they get a hold of this? They might sell them for this so cheap. Cheap nearly four dollars as well. The Crash One? Or... Yeah, Crash One. I think that's the one where NTSC Jet is the 
Yeah. I, th I think it depends on the category you're running, actually. Some categories of, yeah. It's actually better. Because the, the, the J has, like, uh, like some like, routing differences in the levels. And it's better for some categories. Oh, where is... Uh... It's so weird. It's, like, yeah. Nineteen dollars total if you include him. Could buy the right now. I need the memory card annihilator. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you just got a dolly mod so you can play. Yeah, but try try it without wiping it first it'll work so it doesn't then just yeah, do a full I'm pass. just gonna let this do it for like five minutes and then if it doesn't do anything I'm just gonna absolutely obliterate the movie's gun. Is this oh you have, you have to stop yeah yeah I did it's frozen. Yeah. Interesting. Blunt do you mind doing you know me a favor? What's that? Yeah. Pick a number between one and three. Two Neat thank you what, what was that? Oh, I was just picking Car. what card. <laughs> picking what card to get. Yeah. Did this come on, mate? Yeah, this would be easy as fuck to get to, to be honest. Um. Yeah, the train line's right there. That's awesome. I'm gonna have to come back to fucking Australia probably again as well for a different concert. That's in ages. That's 2023. File browser. Mass. There it is. I wouldn't know that installing free reboot would take this long. Oh! Yeah, slot one. If you have any save files, by the way, it'll get rid of them, so. Yeah. I don't think there's anything on there. If it's something you care about, just get rid of it all. Just, uh... What would I. I'm trying to think what I would care about on there. I kind of haven't used it format. I mean, they did it. They just save files. You can always get them back. I have no idea how big this is. What? You can check on. It should say on the on the memory card itself. Yeah, it should say on the memory card. It's blank. I'm gonna unplug oh. it here. Just assume it's 120. Oh, 64, 64. Oh, okay. Never mind. I'm lying. <laughs> Don't exit. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, just, uh, there we are. So this is quick. This is easy. Yeah, this. This is easy. Dude, even Nerf stops streaming. This is how long it is taking. Okay, done. No. Mm. Alright, already I have aired. Wait, load into it, see if it actually flapped it. Why did I X out of that? <laughs> I know the... Now what should I, fa I found not out. Even work? No, don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can always use the other memory card to, to try it on that one as well. I don't know if this is your fix as well, Blunt, but to fix the the disk tray loading, I push it down once and then it works. Yeah, I, I I didn't have to push it down, but I definitely just I usually just take the disc out and put it back in, and then it works. But it, it's probably just me opening and closing the lid, to be honest. Ah, mm. oh, here it is. Wait, it's clicks. Yeah, multi install here. Yeah. Then go OK, yes. And then I wait. Oh, oh yeah. 
So, yeah, okay. Fine. I don't know what was causing it to break. It might have yeah, been just some weird custom, hot, like, hot free McBoot, because, like, yeah. it had the website that I got it from, like, labeled everywhere all over it. It's really? Strange. That's weird, yeah. Oh, it's solved now. Do yeah, I have this to should re... work. Do I have to re mecha pod? No, the mech one is actually on the console itself, not on the memory card. Oh, so. okay. Yeah. Alright, and what was the uh, alpha I downloaded for resolution stuff? What's it called? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, um, it's called uh, PlayStation 1 Video Mode Negator. You can also get um, another one called. Uh... There's another one, I can't remember the name actually. Let me, uh, let me have a look. PS1 V Mode Neg. Yeah, that's the one. That'll allow you to force your game to boot into NTSC instead of NTSC 443, which is what Mechaphone uses for some reason. Uh, yeah, graphics like mode synthesizer, I think, is the other one, but that one's not useful for you, honestly. It won't actually make a difference at all. That's, it gives a mess with it, but yeah. Yeah, there it is. Hopefully, it shows up. Yeah, it showed up. I'm just gonna install PS1 and then plug the hard drive and then test it all. New Wordle. New Wordle, I already got it. It's easy. I've already made the Wordle Wizard one joke, haven't I? No, you haven't. You can make it now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Everything lines up here. Spyro works. The resolution's good. Reboot. I get shimp skip. NTSC, AV. Oh. Like, because NTSC PAL, then NTSC 443. It's like, come on, dude. What? Yeah, there it is. Uh, There's a weird. It still has modchips.co9z. That is so weird. Okay. Yeah. That's super Maybe strange. it's the memory card. Um, Maybe. What should I do? What was it going? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's really strange because you formatted the entire thing, so it's still there. Portion. Yeah. So what you want to do with this, right? Is uh, if you go to the if you go to the freedom book settings, you can uh, map what? L files to uh, to <laughs> essentially like boot on launch. Like you can what boot them like on when the system launches. So what you can make I... this boot once it launches. Please, is it a PlayStation game? To... Oh, that's right. I've yeah, got yeah. A, a silly disc in right now. <laughs> that is a good disc to keep. I actually didn't waste the DVD. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, now you're good. You're pretty done at this point. You, it should all be set up. Um, I can put a backup this. disc in this, and it will. Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, where is my? Uh, one. I used it for a little while when I uh, before I got my retro tank, because the retro tank actually does support NTSC four foot three, but most other cheap upscalers will not. If you ever want to use your ease cap for some reason, um, to actually make it work with this signal, you will have to, um, like, when, once it once, once the ease cap's like plugged in, you have to, like, unplug the video cable and plug it back in, like the yellow cable, like, when the game's already booted, and that should be it. It's, an, it's like a weird workaround with the ease cap, but. Yeah. Once it reads the disc, it should just launch. So, is this a one-off? No, you do this every time. But there's a very oh, easy problem. Okay. Yeah. But I'll, 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 I'll make it something. I'll make it so. I'll help you set it up so it's way you people get to do it for a time. And you have to set one up for each, like one shortcut for each game. No, you, you just set up the shortcut for that software itself, and then like any game will work. With it. Yes, no, you're good now, so now it's, now it's all working. This is so weird on my monitor because it's widescreen. Ugh, the audio is gross. 
Is it like... Muscle, but it sounds like it's not the water. I don't care that much. I just want to speak. It's a really good, um, really good elf download called uh, um, Pad Tester, and it's actually a really good way to kind of measure input lag because uh, you know, like, like instant, instant feedback on like emails and stuff. Using this software, I realized how like how laggy Twitch twos are, like how much of a delay there is on the inputs compared to like a DS1 or a PS1 controller. It's like literally instantaneous on a like a digital controller. But there's a pretty significant amount of delay on a Twitch two. Really? Yeah. Because the button has to like the button has to travel further for it to be registered for the input to actually register. But there's barely any travel time on one of the uh, OG controllers. How is your setup, by the way, for your monitor? Like, what's what's this? Fuck. So, uh, PS2 into shitty upscale, like composite to HDMI. Yep. HDMI is going into Elgato, which is oh, like, and then you have not the, the external, outs. like an internal, like in my computer. Oh, really? Th those are the good ones. And then, yeah, and then that pass through is going to my monitor. I see, I see. I could try and put it on my gaming monitor to see if that makes it even better, but I don't think it would make that much of a difference to be honest. Yeah, maybe there's an option that you can force the S S S ratio to be 4x3 or something. It's yeah, that's, maybe that's on my Elgato settings. But I've got a feeling like the monitor will just be like, oh, it's rich. I mean, the capture looks fine. There's like nothing uh, I, capture. I mean, yeah, that actually looks really good. What? I don't know. For a cheap upscale, it looks pretty good. I'm sure it's being I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's being bottlenecked pretty hard by the upscale of it. Uh, oh, yeah. If you have, if, if you have one of the internal Elgato capture cards, those are like really pretty solid. So. I think it's what Nitrox Nitrox uses. Is, 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 he has no OSSDs. I think how upscale is the Crazy, because I thought Emu was nothing. Well, okay. you were playing on DSC to be fair. God, don't. <laughs> Bet you not. Does Nitrof play on PSC or not? No, I play on PSC. Yeah, yeah, so head all the way down to the bottom setting. Yeah, yeah, for your configurator. This screen should work. Oh, wait, should I drag the ALF onto the memory card instead of having it on this hard drive I have plugged in? Uh, it doesn't matter. Because I'm not going to have it plugged in. Oh, yeah, it's in that like... case, then yeah, put it on the, put it on the uh, USB. Yeah, so what you, uh, you go to uh, launch keys, the E1 launch keys, I believe it is. 
this. Yep. And so, and then, um, so, okay, so you can select a button here to map PS1 video mode indicator to. I think I have it on, like, circle. Um, so, oh. yeah, then, then, now, now, now you go to where the elf fire is. Fire is. So it would be here. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, and then. And then save it, so you want to uh, select it, and then select it, and then uh, go return. And then save config to memory card zero. Yeah. yeah. So what that'll do is that whenever you start off the console, you can hold down circle during the boot process and it'll boot straight into PS1 for the game. Ah, and then you just put your disc in and then yeah. the game launches. That's really helpful. I, you I can do that with any health as well. Much. This shit's so confusing. Yeah. Yeah, I spent like a little while. Like I spent a lot of time just getting used to like all the menus and settings and stuff, so I'm fairly familiar with it. In that same menu, by the way, you can actually you can also map like shortcuts to the menu. Um, it's in like a different menu, but it's in the, in the settings. Oh, is it mark and then? Uh, oh, you want to copy it? Uh, that's okay. Then. Oh, yeah. That'd be it. You can put on memory card zero if you want to. Um, what's, what's zero? Uh, that's one. So so zero is one. Oh, okay. One is two. I oh, I see. So you, you don't have a USB, but you just use hard drive, so then. Yeah, I've got a yeah. hard drive. But like, yeah, I see. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's so funny how slow that is. Yeah, it is. Okay, um... Yeah, now yeah, just do the same thing, uh, but instead of map it to that or file in the other settings. I think I, I usually I usually I usually just restart when I want to get over. Yeah. I think there might be a way. But... It's so annoying that like you can watch Elf like looks fine, but the main menu doesn't for some reason. Like for some reason, yeah. Macbone just wants it to be in this fucked up technology. It doesn't doesn't recognize. Which have a button you want. I'll do square. Yep. And then go return, then save to. I play the button. Yeah. So then... Return, then save to MC0. Yep. And now, when you uh, restart the system and hold down square, you should just boot straight into. That might have actually worked, huh? So if I just hold it square. Wow, that's easy. Yeah, at least we just get in the launches. Let's try. down the whole time. So then it stops doing this. Because mine's got such a bad case of it. Nerf was gonna give me his console. Because I said mine was busted. I was like, yeah, mine does the administration. He's like, ah, mine does that too. So maybe there's no point. I was just gonna give you that. Yeah, it seems like a pretty common like defect. So mine kind of does it, but no, I don't think it's as bad as yours. Let's have 
a look. Oh, that's the thing. Just at this point, Waffle, I think you're good. I think she based that off. Yeah. Working. I appreciate it. Yeah, it's a good. We just haven't helped with this kind of stuff. I'm, I'm lucky you're in the chat. I was gonna message you, yeah. and I was like, I'll black it out, but I'm trying to figure it out. Because I thought my DVD lace was fucked, because I said, like, DVD reader not set up, and I was like, oh. Also, these guys said that was definitely not normal. If I open the disc tray, the disc is incredibly loud when it's spinning. Just insanely loud. It's like, sounds like a helicopter. Sounds like a fucking saw, dude. Oh. Fucking music's not loading. Just stop spinning. There's no way I can run this. Purely on like the disc or like laser side, it should be related to any of the fruit that like make fun stuff. Oh, you fell off. I did. It's so weird playing it stretch because it looks like not good. It looks not. You could have just played through fucking like I don't know uh, OBS preview. No, it's it's worse. It's actually it, way it is worse. it is worse. Yeah. I think Amorak actually has better delay for that kind of stuff. Yeah. Uh, I'll try playing through like Elgato Pastor. Maybe that, oh, yeah. like the Elgato program. So that, you can make like... that screen smaller. Yeah, I, didn't, I, didn't really, I messed with the, uh, with the Elgato game software, with Paint Gift software a little bit, but I didn't really need it too much. But it might be better for the now. OBS preview. It has less lag than our before. Yeah, I think I'll know if the if this was not playable. With this like a lag, this is like And if I got zombie there, this is great. This is like on power with the I'm very happy with that. Yeah, the capture card itself shouldn't be introducing any lag at all. Because it's a, it's a PCIe. Like, it's, you're plugging into your motherboard. Right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So there'll be no delay there. If anything, the only delay that there will be is through, through the upscaler, and I guess a little bit through the monitor as well. Yeah. On widescreen, that looked like it shouldn't have made it. I don't know how to get good upscalers in Australia, though. I got a RetroTing 2X, and it's fucking so expensive to get a shit. Are you even using it? The, the retro tank? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. 
I don't know why, for some reason, I thought you were still using your cheap upscaler. Now I get rid of the I mean, I saw, I saw I actual energy. Your gameplay looks better than this, for sure. I mean, yeah, I can't really tell through, uh, I mean, through, obviously, Discord, it's pretty fucked up, but... Well, you know, it, it's, it's not as clear as it would be on your side, but... Briefly upgraded from, to 900p from 720, it looks so much better. I guess I should try and play PS2 backups now. Yeah, I've never messed, I've yet actually messed with that at all. So, uh, I think games are just. Yeah, I'll just make it fun. That won't mess with anything if I keep reinstalling and make it fun, right? No, I shouldn't. It should be fun. Alright, I'll real. I'm so keen to play Hero's Tale. Um, but it was bad. Make fun is on the hard drive, I think. I'm silly. Can I put that on the memory card as well? Make a pun? Yeah. You could put the installer on the uh yeah. I wouldn't wanna I wouldn't wanna like overload the memory card too much because I think it's it's probably not too big, but sixty four megs. That's purely on all, all that graphical weirdness is purely on the upscale. Like that's just the upscale of what's being yeah. done. Um, but if you were to play on a TV, you wouldn't see it at all. Um, well, the reason, of course, once, uh, the reason I ask is I tried playing PAL games on my PC setup, and literally, like it chops off like a good bottom chunk of it, and the top part of it's like. Yeah, that's. I'd imagine you're, you, um, you're playing on a CRT, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'd imagine it's probably just because your CRT doesn't support PAL games. Got it. Um, yeah. If, if you want to play both NTC and PAL games, you have to have, to have a TV that supports both of them. You know, in in PAL regions, a lot a lot of CRTs do support both, but in NTC regions, it, they rarely do. Got it. Oh, well, I'm lucky that mine does. I, I just had to have. I, I've had this TV for like years, and it just does happen to have. Support for both, luckily. Like, so, any idea if, like, if I were to buy a CRT from, like, a PAL region that does yeah. support both signals, like, what I mean, like, because aren't, like, the power supply is different, or, like, the power. Yeah, you need some sort of converter, I believe, yeah. Some sort of converter. When it comes to like models to look for, I'm not sure. Oh, you have to use yeah. it. Okay. For that matter, Grand best on that one too. I might just not use a hard drive and use some shitty USB and have that just constantly on there. Yes, that's what I do. It's, it's pretty handy. Sticking out of PS2 mostly. I think most USBs should be supported by the PS2, but there are definitely some that aren't. Honey Speedway, let's go! Two times, two times. Yeah, I think. Can't 
This is exactly how I was doing it. So I wonder if the honey speedway portal is going to be a Yeah, it's, that's it, it's worth it. Anything that you feel like you're going to use a lot, it's not just make a shortcut. I don't make a shortcut in the menu, like, you did. is that like a uh, yeah. or whatever? Once, once you're done with this, I can show you how. Oh, is that it? Is that it? Because it looks like I'm going to Honey Speedway for a fourth time. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look like it. Dude, that looks good. like it. Game's busted. No. Oh, okay. That's not real. Uh, tail decks, they patched out like. Yeah, they so, patched out badly. And then. Oh! He's only just Where's gonna. The he's, he's just I must have a gonna... shit version or something. I don't know. I must have an old version. Maybe? If you install the latest version from GitHub, it should be fine. Ah, uh, I downloaded. 1.01. That's the latest version. Shit, I downloaded the one that says Force Unlock Common Mexico. Yeah, I see that. I know what that is. Yeah. Yeah, Dude. Like what am shit. I doing wrong? I'm doing literally exactly what Waffle told me to do. Yeah, this is Waffle's fault. This is all Waffle's fault. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa there, buddy. Wow. wow. Fuck you, man. Like, not just. Just. <laughs> Guess what? I taught you that on purpose so you could never be. This is so true. This is so true. This like war will make the people. Too 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 <laughs> Everyone's too afraid of your power. <laughs> yeah, try try that release. Uh, waffle tip words. Thanks back. I should never have taught you real hard boost. <laughs> you may want to uh, uninstall Mega Pine before you install a new version. Of just okay. Yeah, I think it's just an option with the uh, menu. I assume you saved it back up, right? Oh, yeah. What? Yes! Um, I, okay. I, should I do that now? I'm actually, I'm actually blaming one for that. Uh, it, it, it's the thing in the Mac menu. If you go to the Mac menu, there's like a, oh, an option to like make a backup. I think it forces you to make a backup, actually. So you should have it somewhere. I think it's on the USB. Because Waffle doesn't yeah. play on Grace Hits. I should just yeah, take that out and... Uh, like that, like, uh, he doesn't understand, he's not with it. Yep. Yeah, I think, I think it's good to have a backup for those files. Just to NPM them, I will keep that one. Duck. Back to the next And just to make sure there's still a version on the, uh, the USB as well. Or a copy. Yeah, I think it just needs the power just completely removed for whatever the export. Yeah, it's, it's some some weird hardware exploits. Now you you may want to install it without the force unlock first, just to make sure it doesn't like. Kill for your booty again. Because if it does, 
and you put and you put force on the on, um, then you only use a DVD version of the uh, the launch hole, which may be fine. It may, it may not be I, I use the DVD version, but still, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah. Is like being able to just go back and forth. It, yeah, I believe it is. Yeah. I haven't had any issues with my Metal Freak boot uh, since the since the first time I need to reinstall it. So. I like uninstall. Uh, there should be an option. There should be like a setting that I just like do the backup somewhere. Unless unless you went past already, I'm sure. I mean, you may, not, you may not even need a one sword to be honest, you may just be to go through and do something. So I'll do this now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Is this the new version of Mech by the way? Or is this the old version? Uh, uh, that was the old version, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. New one now. I just didn't want to sort because it's in Mexico and I was like, there's a sort yeah. of Mexican region. Yeah, it seems to it be like, yeah, I think, I think it has like both. Force on the end, some Mexican picks. Or some Mexican patch or something. Yeah, uh, I imagine that's the one I use. Uh, I've always had the force on my option in my Set up a uh, shortcut for Mech right now if you want to. Yeah. Oh, it's just moving into the game. And it's not going to be able to run the game. Of course it works. <laughs> what? No, oh, that's not what I put as. No, no, that's not what I put as. Zero lives, that is. That's a little concerning. So launch, and then I'll move. Die on purpose. Well, first I need to delete this. <sighs> okay. I've always been like asleep when those people are Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, but I've been trying. <laughs> I've been it's trying this. Sometimes they're too you nice. Know, Very crazy. Yeah. 
can make it to get to the next planet with time. But this one you want to go into the uh, the uh, OSDS options. Or OSDS, sorry. And then, um, so on the configure item, you can just press left and right on that option and it would go. So you want to, you want to find like a blank option here? A bit of a blank one? Yeah. And then, for the name. It might take a while. Yeah, and then you just choose a path. Yep. Then. Yep. And then save to MC0 and you're good. It just looks confusing, I guess. Yeah. Yep. It's on my computer, bro. <laughs> oh, we're fine. That's Did way you? easier. <laughs> 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 Did him. Tragedy is struck. Honestly, that looks so close. Yeah, I like landed on it and then just pushed me off. Well, that's not very nice. Uh, there's, there's there we go. Yeah, so that's the back, by the way, the, the restore and we back up, whatever. So that's that's how you are. Uh, I can still make if you ever want to. Oh, is the walls unlocked? Does that have an effect press here? Yeah. There we go. Yeah, so now CDs will no longer work, um, but DVDs should now work. Yeah, I've actually never done this before, so I don't really know how it works, but I'm pretty sure this how it works. Do I still need to use the... This? Uh, this, the disc? this should only work ah. for PS1 games. I see. So it's possible that it won't even... It's possible that you may get glitched video in yeah. Hero's Tale, if it's not work. There may be an option, though, for... Uh, oh. There may be an option for DVD Let's games, I'm sure. It looks like an emulator. <laughs> Hold on. What the fuck just happened? It seems to boot. Whoa, it's in a boot loop. Hold on. Okay, that's uh, not good. Oh. Yep, there it is. <laughs> this is... It's not looking too hot. Okay, I'll try it. That's pretty, that's pretty legit to me. 
<laughs> Maybe a hero's tail. Looks like we're gonna be on EMU. What? By this, then that's actually not that bad. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, that's... Oh, wait, so. Um, did you patch the ISO to be a master disc for the for yeah. Hero Step? Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure yeah. I, did. I used yeah. some ESR patch thing or whatever it's called. I don't know. And then I just said done, and then I put that ISO. The, uh, the the DVDs weren't working with the uh, yeah, with, when you, before you bought them, right? Did you try them or not? Oh, I actually did it. Maybe you could try it without the force on them. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> I'll do that after. Yeah, because it seemed to want to work. Yeah, it was booting into it and then freaking out and then not. Just went blur. I'm reading a conflicting information. Apparently, the force unlock isn't actually necessary, but it, the force unlock um, works, makes it so you can run non master disks. But since you already have master disks, maybe you don't need force unlock. But no, we'll see. It's possible that master disks, disks don't work with the force unlock on the regular disk, too. Still probably to get your glitchy visuals. Yeah. I assume, but uh depends. I feel like maybe because it's a PS2 game and that's like native. It may it may it, yeah, it, it may be different. Oh actually it's still sort of changing the region, so Yeah. Maybe I should have downloaded a power version. Uh I will use the As oh my god, DVD instead of. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah, it's, it, it oh, shows wow. up as a PlayStation disc. Oh, what's that? I've got Spire 2 and I'm silly. Oh. <clears throat> the... Awesome helmet. <laughs> yeah, that was actually pretty solid. I don't think I've ever landed on that like tower thing before. That was a good thing that was there. DVD video. And if it's gonna do the same thing, it'll say DVD not set up. I might try what that guy said. And he said you. Yeah. 
you actually have to put more data on the disk so it's full and then it will work which is so strange and literally in his tutorial he put like a my chemical romance album on the iso <laughs> packed it in and then it worked because it was more full it was so strange i think there was like yeah some sort of thing with like ps1 discs where it has to operate a, a certain amount of disk space otherwise nothing nothing works yeah i think uh, I, I think actually the spyro games do that right they have a bunch of like filler files like, like in them do they that's awesome yeah it's like a really like really big like text still documents lags, and stuff like, it's a lofty smh games from that era like had very tight like memory tolerance or tolerances as well um, checking PS2. when i was i didn't open it with the right thing when i was modding like twist metal 2 for the pc um the model that you had like anything you changed like texture wise or anything had to equal the exact file size of the thing you just replaced otherwise oh, yeah. it's all fucked now granted i wasn't doing that very long because i got sucked into speed running and that took off that uh, actually took off dude if that effect wasn't so harsh on the eyes it would actually be kind of cool more like the well i Which guess if I don't know. It because it moves the whole thing as well. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I think FDS is off, and this is still quick. Yeah. My eyes. For the company for Do you know the trick with keeping FDS on, by the way? If you no. um, so you turn off the console fully, right? So it's a like red light. Yeah. You turn it on, and then when it starts up, like as soon as it begins to start up, you reset the console. And then after you put FDS on, it should stay on until you fully turn off the console again. Um, so start the console, restart the console when it is, when it starts up, then enable the FDS, and then it will continue to stay on through resets. Super. Yeah, I noticed Super. like it takes it resets on the first reset, but not yeah yeah. Afterwards. I'm gonna test a normal PS2 game. That's PAL region and see if that. Let's put in motherfucking Spider Man. Spider Man? Spider Man for the PS2. Ah. Yeah, I don't have any experience with PS2 games in Mech with Mech Bones. I can't really help you there. You just have to mess with it and see if you get something to work. If this shows up as DVD video, it's over. Oh, PlayStation 2 disc. Please stop the glitching. Oh. Well, it won't read, will it? That's pal. It'll be nice. What? I mean, yeah. it should read. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is a pal disc. Oh, wait, no, 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 it won't read. It won't, it won't read because you've set your console to be an NTC console. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's what I'm reading. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, yeah. hang on. <laughs> I'll just have to repatch it to power when I want to oh play. Oh my god, yeah. this is making my head hurt, dude. That's so much work. It's fine. I'll, I'll only gonna really be using Spyro one, two, three. Yeah, if you're only ever playing one game, or like like PS one, it's really simple if you just play PS one games. Just it always yeah. works fine. Fine. Literally everyone else on the board is playing Pat. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't know why I thought to just not get a copy. I'll just wait until yeah. it's a good price one. Uh, actually, is that... I, know, right? I, I mean, okay, actually, there are some NTSC versions, but there's, it's pretty much a 50 50 split. Lord Record Holder uses PAL, so, you know, don't worry about it. <laughs> yes, Lord Record Holder, all three, had a 
doors in here, so this is how, so it's not even like port of port for the best control. So here's the first. Mm -hmm. Yes, no, it's in the it's in the main menu. Press triangle to You press triangle to get a version. And then options and then yeah, down FTS, yeah. If you, if you did it right, if you if you like launched the console and restarted it once, and then enabled it, yes, it should be fine. How many seconds is it for Spire to launch? It's six six point four from the last cutscene. Sorry, I'm dumb. This is far too. CFG. What are you talking about? How many seconds is it for FDS, like from the start menu to FDS? Yeah, 26. I'm gonna count in my head. Just put a shoe on top of it, it'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put a spot on top of it. have this problem. It's got a spoon in it. Hey, it's working. I'll just keep that glass there forever. I think it's... He's not coming out of that. Yeah, I don't know how Spar 1 body trains work, but if they continue when they oh, stop... Oh, do they... They, they do... They get stuck, I feel. He's perpetually he, flying. He, he's not... Oh, oh, oh yeah. the mine is back. I, I'm lying. He's alive. Yeah, for whatever reason they can't Anyway, uh, 
that spiral. That glass is staying there forever, literally. <laughs> That's fine. It'll all be fixed if Kashi sends me the two hundred and ten dollar offer for the pink PlayStation. It's also the same up floor. I think it's a bit it's just a seventy or something. Yeah. It's, it's somewhere in the seventy range, I'm pretty sure. I mean seventy seventy Ks don't work for me fine remember, so only seventy five not. You are flying with the fuck these loads, dude. I know, it's actually... I have to think I could have started this so much sooner. I was just not playing it through off guard, I was playing on a TV and I was like, wow, this is not playable. No, it's just the, the TV sucks. Or oh, was it just some like old plasma or something? Yeah. Oh no, not even plasma, an LCD. This is like some oh, yeah. cheap. This is. Ugh. I wonder how free a PB will be now. I don't know, you still have to play the game. Minus 40, right? <laughs> Minus 40, bro. When I moved the console, like, every single split was just a gold, it was so easy. I mean, it is technically, you know, free gold, for sure. But well, I'm pretty good on Emu. <laughs> That's the issue. Well, then you're just gonna bang out a 241. Like, no biggie, you know? Try. I mean, muscle. Memory. Fifty gifted. Fifty. No. Hey. Close. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> mm, getting closer. Yeah, you're going so early, dude. I'm going. I think the delay is better. Dude, my eyes are deceiving me. So early, bro. Okay, I'm really gonna have to adjust my timing here. 99 lives code. Left. <laughs> Not actually, just no, left. No, you're going plenty left, don't even worry. <laughs> Too left. <laughs> oh. oh, what are you doing? You got him out of his animation. Oh. Oh. Ah. Uh. Scenery. Shit. Tr I tried. Yeah, okay. This is different to Emu. In a good way. I think Shimp will be more free now. Because it's like snappier. Ugh. Ugh. Are you playing on like a just regular TV, I'm assuming? Not like a series. I'm playing on my monitor. Listen, what would I have to do for a 90k again? Can I do anything? A 90k? Yeah. What's that? I don't think Mecha Point doesn't work in 90k, right? Yeah, no. Does it not? There's no. something Lewis. else. Didn't Mecha Point Fortuna? Actually, wait, no. I think maybe it does, but I think Freebie Boot doesn't work on some 90ks. I think it's. I think that's what 
the issue is, right? I have no idea. There, there, there is there is some issue with 90k. Is it? Is either like one of? I think some 90k models free free movement works fine, but others doesn't. Uh, so you can, oh, there is Fortuner, of course, if you, if you need that. I don't understand what any of these programs are, dude. <laughs> yeah, I mean, okay, yeah, free boot is like the soft mod like thing that gives you access to like you launch off so you can like load files in. Fortuna is like the same thing but different. And then Megapone is like the, the recent unlocker. Let's you play NTSC games. Yeah, I think generally the 75k and the 77k are the the easy options to go for. Uh for just compatibility. <laughs> For, for, for power, at least. If you're on NTSC, it doesn't really matter. Let's go with whatever. Whatever works. Um. Yeah, hold on. Let me switch up. Oh, dude, I'm fucked. I just searched on cash converters in their search box. Cash converters. <laughs> <laughs> dude. So, pink PS2s, if they're power region, they are. I'm pretty sure they're a 70. Okay. Yeah, that's good. That's fine. It is? Okay. Yep. Oh! Never mind, there's multiple. Some are 77, some of them. Some are 70k. 77k are Japan region. Can you make a fun Uh, that's a good question, I'm not sure. Uh, it's like some wacky shit. It is 77. Oh, that's Oceania region. So. Maybe. AMAREC. It's like a weird Japanese program. It's, it's kind of, it's kind of weird to set off, but it's worth a try. Uh, I'm sure it doesn't like weird scuff or so. You shouldn't need the video, the video uh, codec whatever it tells you to download. That should be fine to just skip. But Amor Amorex, what everyone used before, like OBS, was they had like native functionality, but capture cards, I think. Amorex TV.exe. Please choose a video capture device. Oh, okay. So you can yeah, so like capture HD60. Yeah. There's a bunch of tabs up the top left. You just want to go through them, like left or right. I don't, have, I don't think I have it installed right now. I might. Let me check. Five dollars. Oh hell yeah! Wait. Can I just type a square resolution? Oh wait, I think you can. Car is not square. What resolution is the PlayStation? Uh, that's a good question. Yeah. Uh, it varies by game. Are you in graph one or graph two? I'm on graph one. Yeah. Uh, it should be like it's a set of a set of resolutions, right? Like 720 by 480 and shit, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just select a, just, yeah, just select like 720 by 480. Okay. 16 bit. Graph two has like more settings as well. Oh, by three, there it is. Yeah. Yeah. Custom the custom ratio as well. You shouldn't really need to mess with the the influence stuff too much. You can if you want. 
you just can just kind of mess with that and just get a feel of what looks good, or you can just leave it how it is, it shouldn't even matter too much. And then everything past graph 3 is not relevant, you can just leave that. Nice. A graph is stops. Full stop. <laughs> uh, let's look at the graphs then. Resolution is like a graph one, it may have a. I think something that can break. Simply What's the bit? 80, 16. 16, yeah, that should be fine. Though. What is changing? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty weird. When it works, it works pretty well though. It's kind of weird. It's still breaking when you press OK. Yeah, uh, when I click the play button. I'll also have the same issue, hold on. Oh, wait, no, the, the, you, should, you shouldn't have to play the play button. You should just be as you are. But once you select your options, the black screen should hopefully just uh, work and, and display correctly. Oh, even if I open it, it'll just sort of do the error. Oh, okay. The codec. Okay, never mind. I guess I'm done. I, I didn't until the codec worked fine, but maybe you do sometimes. Yeah, not install a MM2 codec. I think I already forgot how you're supposed to do Here we go. Did you save Boar? Yeah. Waffle, isn't it for Boar like the inverse of the track glide motion of the controller? Yeah, kind of. Charge jump into a really quick glide into a
Whoa, is there a fucking Misty Bog Pal version or something? I'm hearing a very strange soundtrack right now. Uh, part one is some like unused like oh, super tracks I'll... that play through when you go. Yeah, yeah. If I've you're in the there high for a long caves time. one, yeah, or whatever. But this one, have you heard this? I'm very mad that I'll have DSC instead of the high caves soundtrack that Hal and the DSC J got. To be honest, I'm pretty sure the soundtrack was just the the pillow one that plays it. Like, I feel like I've heard this in a big craft of the It's here. I mean, it's basically like losing people's bills. Yep. That'll play if you hang around in the place too long. Or that's one of them, anyways. Still got a bunch more races to go though. Pretty sure I'm not gonna finish this game tonight though. <laughs> Had a few setbacks. Done. I'm not playing Spyro the game. Shit sucks. That's true. That's true. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Apart from some people that apparently gives them the best latency, but if it doesn't work, then just don't worry about it. I would it's like pretty to messy, try. though. Yeah. Because if I can get some good latency out of here.
Yeah, I'll grab that HD60 Pro. How the hell is... Surely there'll be some low latency.
Hey, good morning, Chloe. Not gonna lie, that kind of startled me, though. I'm sorry. It's fine. The god, like, drunk as fast, slept for four hours. My brain's like, alright, time to get up and do something. I don't know why. Like, fucking teenagers. I don't know. Like, high speed, like, just speed ran getting sober. Yeah, like, what the fuck? Like, I'm not hungover or anything. I just got up, drank some Gatorade, and I'm fucking chilling. I'm gonna spend the day doing a fucking job surgery. Maybe you blood. Hey, now you can see what I'm seeing. See this on this one? My camera. This is what oh, I'm yeah. seeing. It looks it's it's nice. pretty wide. <laughs> pretty wide, yeah. I don't know if I can play like this. What's this? What's special about this? I've got my PS2 to watch. Oh, but cool. I'm on widescreen. So I'm playing on CRT. Oh, yeah. I can actually play from a preview though. This one. Disgusting. It's fucked up. That feels like an MRA, but oh shit. Why is everybody doing any percent suddenly? Yeah, ask me Holy the same shit. question like two, like two months ago. I probably would have been because I woke up more than one but that's some forty. It was like, hey, maybe I should try that. Oh my God, I, I'm watching Nova stream and she's practicing magic stairs. And Absence just in chat and says the first person to get these magic stairs should have kept quiet about it. <laughs> that's I mean, such an amazing. I'm not sure. <laughs> Well, I reckon someone probably would have figured out and go, Guys, check this out. <laughs> no, even if the first... the fuck up. We did not get it. <laughs> even if the first... It's like swept away like the nice. fucking, like, FBI. <laughs> fucking men in black neuralizing. <laughs> it's a fucking government agency specifically tailored to keeping certain Vortex strats in the ramps. I still think the way that Nova goes for magic stairs is literally just like... Hell yeah. No fucking science stairs. God ah, damn it! The poser, when he does magic stairs, he ends up on the right, so that's just faster. If like, you end up on the left side, you have to run further to the vortex end. It's, it's probably still a little bit faster. I tend to go for a, like a Deo mentality when doing stuff. Like, consistency is more important than doing cool shit. Oh, I got that cool thing I'm doing. I'm gonna go for eight full times. Right now. No, I was just saying. No, there. Yeah, that's what, that's what I'm gonna oh. do. Yeah. I looked at your stream and you were literally just, you literally just started the game and I'm like, oh, what? That I'm fucking sick. I'm like, yo, cutscene skip? Mm -hmm. Okay, what? <laughs> I sort of had seven toes this time. No? Why? Uh, not this shit again. <laughs> Damn it. Honestly, you might just play with widescreen. I'm gonna hit you with the fucking wide poop like I, I hit might just get used to it. <laughs> it's gross, but like, I can get, I can get used to it, I think. Uh, what else is gross? That fucking wall of life. What the fuck? Kid, those are gonna take work and practice, but after he'll uh, he'll get it. Six hours in, still a solid college try. I respect it. He'll get it. Just gotta keep plugging away at it. Uh, the feed died. How am I supposed to tell if you fuck up the goop jump again? Opening OBS. There you go. Feed is back on. It's not cropped. What the hell's happening? But like, did you make it? What the fuck? It's so wide. That's amazing. I'm gonna leave it saying Duck Station. Okay. Back. What is this layout? I love it. 
the live split in text. No, you're missing the, uh, the fucking unregistered hypercam 2 at the top. <laughs> like you're actually recording an XP background. <laughs> yeah, I should actually. That's a good point. What is that? Oh my god, that BRB is amazing. There's cats in a potato chip. That was cool. Huh? Yeah, it's just placeholder. Wacky got shit. The, you got that flappy bird text for the BRB. Throw up a fucking, like, Windows <laughs> XP screensaver. I was thinking of that. Uh, I tried like to BRB find screen, one. Like, pipes. Yeah, like, I tried to find, like, an OBS. Holy shit, that was high. Like, yeah, uh, I got four OBS. Yeah, in a row now. This is... Oh, Chloe, to get all the sources for this layout, I used a VM with Windows XP on it. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. I, well, I tried to find, like, an OBS... Um... God, words are hard. Um, like an OBS plugin that would, like, simulate Windows screensavers, but no one's made one, so now I'm sad. I'd have to, like, use a... V like, actually download the fucking screensaver and record it or something, but then it would be the same every time, and that's not nearly as fun. I want to have, like, the 3D pipes, but it's different every BRB. That'd be cool. Minecraft on Windows XP. Hmm. Doesn't work, I know. I just had to have Minecraft in there. It's crazy to me that I remember using Windows XP, but Minecraft doesn't work on Windows XP. That's so weird. Oh. Hey, nice bounce. Thanks. That's Pog. Very Pog. Wide screen's free. I'm not even going to bother adjusting anything. Actually, wait, can I play through OBS, or is that still bad? Is it weird that it's, it's like, it must be like one frame difference, but it feels massive. Well, yeah, because you're doing high level movement, so you're very sensitive to it. Oh, Damn. Yes, definitely more than one frame. That boar wanted none of your shit. I don't think it's more than one frame for mine. Mine is like definitely like a solid like four or five. Mine's definitely like one. Mm, and it's like. Practicing. Let's see if I can get the third monitor working today. That'd be helpful to have another stream. Tell me you're not a miracle worker, Chloe. Okay. Oh boy. Can't wait to get another small stack of change. Let's see if this monitor actually wants to work today. Motherfucking Nova stream. Hmm. Actually, got a card. Eat. Motherfucking wide Putin. Can't respond. Bump. 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 Six 
Bro, that's like minimum wage, what the fuck? PS2 to HDMI converter Elgato pass through pass through PC monitor. Yeah. Well, the PC monitor itself is already adding at least a frame. That's all right. Most what I'm saying is like through everything else, there has to be at least one other frame of delay. I yeah, you are right. Depending on the converter. Oh, this feels faster than Emu. I'm not even kidding. Well, yeah, it's definitely faster than Emu. Like, um, no, no, as in like the input even lag. The, yeah, like even the jankiest setup is gonna have less delay than emulator. What are you playing through right now? I'm playing on pass through, but. Uh, I don't know, I'm really considering playing on OBS because it's like one frame. I, I'm looking side by side, it looks like one frame because the capture card's PCIe. Okay, 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 what was that? Alright, that's it. Retiring from Spyro speedrunning. I don't know what happened. I might video this and compare in a frame by frame. I'm gonna move on to being a full time monster runner, runner, or monster uh, racer runner. No, I'm gonna be. Damn. If you get unlucky, you just reset. Get like eight hours in. Very cool. You should, uh, just do, uh, Forbidden Memories instead, that fits the vibe. Or just run Bash, that works too. Mm -mm. Well, that works too. They've uh, already... <laughs> Besides, they've already done that before. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I ran Bash just a time. Oh shit, you should, uh, practice for the 1545 again, Smiley Face. It's one frame different. Holy shit. I'm playing on OBS preview. That's it. Oh god. That's a good one. <laughs> I wish I was joking. I know. I wish you were too. <laughs> I understand. And Sag. <laughs> yeah, it's light. I did, but. Yeah, I'm also life. going to go to bed. <laughs> yeah. Awful. yeah, it's like almost 7 a.m. where I'm at. It must be really late for y'all. Yeah, it's 4 a.m. I'll get you guys tomorrow. Yeah, man. And a rain supreme, let's go. 
it is now. The world is right side up again. <laughs> now the Australians and the Kiwi have gone. <laughs> Which one's the key? Yeah. Of course. But according to Asla Tavi, uh, Waffle's got dual citizenship. I thought it was triple. Oh yeah, it was triple because Asla thought Waffle was American. <laughs> Work from home doing laundry and make up the twenty dollars per hour. Not me. <laughs> it literally the company's called Sudshare. You pick up people's laundry and, and you just it and return it. That's not from home. What the fuck? <laughs> you gotta drive can... to get the fucking laundry. <laughs> okay, you're me out here. DoorDash but for clothes. <laughs> That's basically what it is. <laughs> I'm not trusting a stranger with my fucking clothes. Well, here's the thing. You're the stranger that they're trusting with their clothes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't want a stranger's clothes. It's gross. I barely like doing using a shared laundry.
Okay, I'm back. Hi there. I left over 12 hours ago. <laughs> Everyone's nice. I have a you. very important pressing question for you, Dylan. Yeah. Were the words you said before you left? Don't worry, guys. I'll be right back. Yeah. Hell yeah. Based. <laughs> New York. New York. Maybe don't get mega specific since I am streaming at the moment. Oh, uh, you know, I'm in one of the five boroughs. Uh, I'm down the street from Quiznos. Just kidding, I would never live near Quiznos. Fuck Quiznos. It's a WWE game, so I can't really say anything. <laughs> Lately, my Elden Ring has been, like, five-year-old mod in Minecraft. Good Elden Ring, I like that one. What mods? It's just, like, some weird fucking pack that some friends are doing. It's like... It's like 1.710, so it's like... All the usual stuff from like back in the day. I've put like, let's see how let's see how many fucking hours I've put into this shit. Three days, six hours in like the past two weeks, probably. Like binging it hard as fuck. server's gonna die because people got bored, so that's lame. So I'm gonna start it. It's a little player map at some point with a different one. Hmm. I don't know if I had a fucking Minecraft server. Server yeah, had another one. The only, uh, the only Minecraft mod I ever really played for like an extended period of time was like Pixelmon. I did like FTV and a couple of other ones, but love the kitchen sink packs. I always do all the tech shit. Make it yeah. I respect people who have like the attention span for it. I just like mentally like, like what do I need? And they'll be like, alright, you need this thing. How do I get it? There's like seven five steps. Oh, no. I love that shit so much. I respect it. I mean, what about it, dude? I just, again, fucking squirrel brain. I don't, I don't like, fucking think about doing things for that long, oftentimes. Like, I think it's, um, is it Draconic Evolution is, like, the name of that? Draconic's fucking wonky. It's, like, everything in it you have to do, like, 75 things for. It's, and it's, like, do be the most busted shit ever. Yeah, I mean, I'm glad, like, it actually like, warrants it, though. Like, if they were just like a bunch of steps for like something kind of mediocre and like, what the fuck. No, it's not industrial craft. <laughs> Fucking me, industrial craft is trash. Description. Bell Press is committed to bring Jesus' healing wherever we live. I'm like, oh, wait. Oh. I think I clicked on the wrong one. <laughs> Jesus' is healing? Uh huh. What is this, a Presbyterian church? Depressed? Perfect. The only. 
denomination I'm familiar with are like fucking Methodists and stuff. They don't tend to be too bad. Gotta watch out for those sneaky Mormons too. be like, people forget that Latter-day Saints is the fucking Mormons. And so you don't realize that it's the fucking Mormons. I think it's just some normal, weird fucking denomination. There were so many. Or the Seven-Day seven day Adventists, which are just fucking psychos. What you up to today, Dylan? Uh, I need to at some point do some Doriani to make sure I don't completely suck in the re relay. Um, I'm still trying to I'm pretty sure I'll be fine. Yeah. I th yeah, you and Charity have been pretty well practiced, I'd say. I just haven't done any in like two and a half weeks, so. Right. But. I gotta try to do a reset, let's see how it goes. I'm still trying to figure out how to divvy up the teams because I'd say everyone's actually pretty close. Fair. I think aside from that, I'm gonna play the new WWE game. First closet in the cloud. Uh, well. It's a rental runway. Rental runway. 
gun weighs actually pretty neat. Wait, so is it like... It's like an anti... Socioeconomic disparity. I, God damn it, there's like an actual word for it. But it's like an anti bat company. Just like. Basically, like sharing clothes and like sending it to other people. So that things don't just get worn once but thrown away. It's kind of neat. This is literally the first I've heard of like someone. Subs you can get like subscriptions and they'll like send you stuff and then you wear it for a while and send it back and you don't have to send it to someone else. This is literally the first I've heard of rich people buying clothes to wear once and then tossing out.
Symmetra. Isn't that a fucking Overwatch hero? Yep. Yeah. Alright. Flip the coin. Heads, it's Nova. Tails, it's Basti. Basti it is.